What's going on guys, my name is Will and welcome to PLC85, so for everything new with gaming and funny reaction videos, subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell because we go live every single day and we post videos every single day. Now today's episode we will be reacting to Pitch Me to Age of Ultron. This is where Wanda and Vision got their debut so i decided you know what i have yet to see in this pitch meeting and what a perfect time that this and what a perfect time for me to react to this pitch meeting so without further ado let's get inside the video So you have a new Avengers script for me? <laughs> yes, sir, I do. And this one starts off with the Avengers doing some super awesome uh, murder. Super oh, it awesome does. Murders, yeah, it's going to be cool. like 10 solid minutes of the Avengers murdering and cracking jokes and murdering and cracking jokes. That is so <laughs> yeah. And how are the Avengers getting along without Tony? Oh, well, he's right there with them. Didn't he kind of retire at the end of True. Iron Man 3? Yeah, that's right. So what explanation are we giving for his return? None whatsoever huh so what's the movie about well it's called age of ultron oh age of ultron so this takes place over several years yeah no just a <laughs> oh, you know what the word age means i do not i do not it's a tough word yes yeah, sounds cool though age of ultron it does sound cool so anyway using loki's scepter iron man wants to create an ai called ultron that can achieve peace in our time oh that's nice yeah but then ultron understands his purpose as oh i need to murder everyone <laughs> whoopsie so ultron whoopsie. attacks the avengers while they're getting drunk and then escapes through the internet. He escapes through the internet. Yeah, so now he has access to every system on Earth except nukes. Oh, that's except cool. So nukes. what's his plan? Is he gonna, like, take down the electrical grid? Nope. Something with the water supply? Nuh-uh. Air traffic control? Nope. All of the Avengers super advanced technology? No, those sound like good ideas, but what he really plans on doing is making a city fly and throwing it down to Earth. Oh, you'd think a genius AI would be able to think of a better plan than that. You'd think so, but he's really into the city throwing <laughs> idea. Interesting. So anyway, Ultron is this super scary, super intimidating robot. You should have him crack jokes like Loki. What? People love Loki. Yeah, but why would a robot crack jokes? So he could be more like Loki. I actually like okay, Ultron. People Stop love this. Loki. Oh, uh, is this so you can sell Ultron toys to kids? Maybe. We sold a lot of Loki toys. Well, why didn't you say so? The movie's already a big commercial anyway. Ugh, I love you so much. <laughs> oh, stop. What kind of commercials are we talking? Well, for example, the Hulk listens to music to calm down, right? Okay. On his wireless Beats by oh. Dre headphones. Oh, awesome. That's a product. Or like Hawkeye and Black Widow drive around, right? Yeah. In a brand new state of the art Audi. That's amazing. That's a product. We also find out what Iron Man likes to wear under his armor. Uh-huh. Any idea what brand he wears under his armor? No under idea. Armor. He wears under <laughs> armor. Under his armor. I never you thought that. You just blew my mind. That's a product. I never thought that. It's not just that. a commercial for products. It's also a commercial for movies. What other movies? Our future movies. How'd you do that? Well, we're introducing this character named Scarlet Witch that gives people visions. Okay. And so she gives Thor a vision that's a setup that for That gives Thor people wow. visions. And she gives Tony a vision that's, that's a setup for Avengers 3. I love it. So what else happens in the movie? Well, after the witch gives people a bunch of visions, she makes the Hulk go crazy and so Tony has to stop him. How does he manage that? He developed this new super powerful Hulkbuster armor and so they just destroy this a bunch of buildings. Oh, Tony has a suit upgrade, huh? So I bet much. that'll come in handy against Ultron. Yeah, no, he's only gonna use it once. Oh, so anyway, then they all go hide <laughs> out with Hawkeye's family. What happens there? Well, Natasha and Bruce have a long conversation about how they should have showered together. What? Yeah, they're in love now. Oh, they are? Yeah, I decided that would be a thing. Cute. And then Thor pieces out because he had a bad dream. And then Nick Fury secretly hides out in a barn to surprise Tony, even though he meets with everyone minutes later and had no reason to hide. Dramatic entrance, I guess? Yeah. Yeah, let's go with that. And what does Thor go off and do? He goes to take a bath with Eric Selvig. Oh, <laughs> kinky. No, he jumps into a dream puddle and learns about Infinity Stones. Oh, is that a commercial? Commercial for, for an upcoming movie, that's right. I love it. So anyway, Ultron tries to put himself in a body type thing, but then the Avengers steal it. Oh, they do. Yeah, and then Tony convinces Bruce that they have to do the exact same thing they did with Ultron again. He wants them to redo the thing that created a death robot. That's right. God, is it going to be hard to convince Bruce to do super it? Easy, no, super barely easy, barely an inconvenience. Really? Yeah, he basically says that they're both monsters, and for some reason that convinces him. That was easy. Anyway, so they do the thing again, but this time Thor hits it with some lightning, and that creates a really nice dude named Vision somehow. It's crazy how science works, isn't it? Yeah, I literally don't understand it. <laughs> Me neither. Also, Ultron is gonna kidnap Black Widow. He's gonna kidnap her. Why wouldn't he just kill her? I don't know, I guess to lure the Avengers over? Wouldn't they have gone anyway if Ultron is lifting a city into the sky? Yeah, you'd hope so. So how does the movie end? Well, you know how in the first Avengers, 
years we had them fighting like a generic army of aliens. Yeah. Well, this time we're gonna switch things up a bit. Oh yeah? Now it's gonna be a generic robots. army of robots. <laughs> Very cool. Also, one of the Avengers is gonna die. What? Which one? Quicksilver. Oh, I don't even know who that is. Yeah, we only introduce him in this movie. I'm not sure that he's actually an Avenger. How does he die? Well, Hawkeye is about to get shot, so Quicksilver uses his super speed to stand in front of the bullets. He has super speed? That's right. Why doesn't he use that to get them out of the way instead of stepping in front of bullets? I don't know. <laughs> Plus, there's a huge scene earlier where he moves a bunch of people out of the way of a moving train, <laughs> so he dies. Yeah, and also, Tony, <laughs> Thor, and Vision are all hitting Ultron at the same time, and he starts to die. Amazing. And then they all stop and let him get away. Why? I don't know, but Scarlet Witch kills him later. Well, good. And then in a mid credit scene, we're gonna have Thanos show up. Oh, what does he do? He puts on the Infinity Gauntlet, and he's like, fine, I'll do it myself. What's he talking about? Getting the Infinity Stones. Was Ultron trying to get him Infinity Stones? Nope. So what's he talking about? Getting the <laughs> Infinity Stones. But that line doesn't make sense in the context of this movie. Yeah, but he wants them. But what's he talking Infinity about? Stones. Getting the Infinity Stones. <laughs> Never mind. Anyway, so Tony retires from being Told Iron you. Man again. Oh, but he'll be back, right? No, this time he's retiring for real. He's never putting that suit on again. Uh, Iron Man's new suit and tech. Hey guys, Ryan here. Thanks for watching. <laughs> I said it once. I said it twice. I said it a million times. How does he come up with this? Like, how do you think? I've seen this movie so many times and I've missed a lot of the jokes about the movie that doesn't add up or doesn't make sense. And he just pins them each and every time. I love that about him. Ryan George is funny AF. Now about, that was a perfect pitch meeting. I love it. Nothing bad to say. Everything was hilarious. One division. Guys, are you watching one division? I, I had to do this video because this is where Wanda and Vision first came up. I didn't even know that they were going to have a romance like that. As I said before in my last thing, I'm not a, my last post, my apologies, I'm not a big comic book guy. So I never really followed the story of Wanda and Vision. I didn't know that that was a whole thing that happened. I'm more of the cartoon guy. I skimmed over a few comic books. But Mr. F, thank you very much for sending me that link with a bunch of comic books. So I'll be reading up on all these comic books really, really, really soon. But as I said before, guys, that's the video. Guys, if you want to check out our other reaction videos, you can check out one here. And for fun with Will and Ali, it's some more reaction videos with me and my partner. You can check that out too. Also, we have a bunch of gaming footage that you can go and enjoy. And as I said before, we do go live every single day. So don't forget to drop a like. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And don't forget, guys, where there's a will, there's always a way. Stay golden, my friends. And thank you for watching.